This tutorial demonstrates how to see and use the data associated with Maptitude Maps. Each country package that is available for Maptitude includes dozens of geographic files, all of which have tabular data associated with them. At a minimum, the administrative boundary layers have a name field and an area field. The populated places layers include place names and populations. And where available, demographic data are also included. For example, the United States Country Package includes tracts, counties, county subdivisions, MSAs, and states, all with hundreds of fields of demographic data from the Census, American Community Survey, and other sources. You can use the Info tool to see the data associated with a particular feature. First, choose the layer whose features you want to query from the drop-down list to make it the working layer, or right-click on the layer in the Display Manager and choose Make Working Layer. Then, use the Info tool to click on a feature in the map. An info window pops up where I can see, in this case, income data for Miami, population, age distribution, race, ethnicity, ancestry, and so on. Hold the shift key down and click on another feature to compare features side by side in the info window. You can also display tabular data for the entire layer in the data view by right clicking on the layer in the display manager and choosing new data view. You can control what fields are displayed, how they are displayed, edit data, and create formula fields in the data view. For example, you can make a column wider or narrower by dragging its heading like this. You can hide columns by highlighting some cells and clicking the Hide Column button. You can lock one or more columns so that they are always visible as you scroll through the data. And you can click either of these buttons to sort a column in ascending or descending order. You can create a formula field using data from the data view by clicking the formula field button and entering a formula manually or with a formula builder. In this case, I'll create a formula that is population divided by area, and I'll call this field density. Mattitude calculates the results and displays the formula field at the end of the data view. Use the Column Settings button to change the formatting of a column. For example, to change the number of decimals in the formula field that I just created, choose the field from the data grid, choose a format, and click OK. And finally, you can sort columns in a data view. You can highlight a column and click the left or right keys on your keyboard to move it, like this. Or you can click the Data View Fields button and choose exactly which fields you want in the data view and in what order. And that wraps up this tutorial on working with data.